Hello there, my name is Vishal from MyWeb and in this video, I am going to show you how to fetch your all the category data in your page. In the last video, you are validate or, uh, validate or slug URL and modify and validate with a unique custom slug URL using our slug 5 function. Now, uh, as you can see, in the last video, also validate it. If I click on the empty data, so it shows a uh, error message is please fill the category field and when you click on this field like mobile and click on the save that is nothing to show us but uh, our data is also stored into our category table okay see mobile mobile and here is your date which is created on now let's begin to fetching our all the data with our get method. First of all, we need to go to our crud.php file. Here is our crud category.php. So here is your class folder and here, here is our crud.php. And after the insert function, uh, I expand it. Okay. After the sluggy five function, I write uh, take another function public public function and method name is get and I take a SQL query so SQL equal to select all from category category table name is category S colon now we need to prepare our query prepared our we need to prepare our query so I take a comment prepare our query okay so take a variable name which is statement okay uh, or you can also write a shortcut name which is stmt ok dollar this our database connection prepare our sql ok after that we need to execute our query so execution our prepared method okay dollar stmt arrow execute okay and after that we need to fetch our fetch our data fetch all data from the table okay dollar statement array and fetch all sorry it's uh, fetch fetch all and I stored into a local variable so result equal to this and return it okay dollar result now after that uh, I am coming back to the my category.php and our first action to fetch uh, sorry include the uh, include the crowd.php file so again I write require once and we have class folder and that class folder we have our crud.php okay and here is one back one way back folder so dot dot slash forward slash okay and after the closing tag of model okay before the closing tag of section I just print the whole thing uh, for checking that if method is working or not so dollar php okay uh, open the close dollar make I make object of that thing 
of that uh, get method so another object new crud okay and dollar obj get and i print print underscore r okay now press the control s and check into the browser you can see here is our uh, data let's see uh, echo for make a readable data so make it readable okay now again refresh okay here here you can see we have two types of uh, data which one is uh, uh, we have two types of keys which is the first one is associative key and one is index key so uh, we need just simple associative key okay of uh, take another category name which is laptop and save refresh see here is your laptop and here is your laptop so we need to validate with uh, some okay in the fetch all function we need to define which which kind of data we need to fetch fetch from your data uh, fetch your database so i write pdo colon colon fetch underscore soc okay now press the control s check in the browser refresh now you have only associate key for our database now uh, coming back to your category.php file and I remove this thing and okay oh, okay uh, I cut this thing cut this line and paste at the top or uh, top of this page okay and I remove this here is your model data so I just uh, expand it I take table dot table class dot table bordered and after that take it table row and we need table head which have uh, three or four columns okay id category name date and our action pages and also a uh, result edit and delete okay I take another table row which have table data sorry file now I take a for loop for this for each loop so again I start the PHP and for each dollar our obj array and uh, method name is get as dollar row okay I open the curly braces and delay I just open and close the closing with PHP tag and again close this thing okay now uh, I just uh, write our first category name only uh, which is category underscore ID okay so I write PS open the PHP echo dollar row array and the key name is category underscore id and 
and save now check in the browser refresh here as you can see here is our two data let's check okay mobile and laptop and one two now uh, I copy this again control C and control V and change the ID with only name mm, here is your date so what's your name of date cat created underscore at cat underscore created underscore at okay now press the control s and check in the browser refresh okay as you can see here is your uh, category name which one is mobile and laptop uh, now we need to write uh, edit and delete so i take a anchor text so a dot btn dot btn's hyphen primary hashtag because we are working on letter and edit okay anchor and this is for delete so btn btn hyphen danger delete press the control lesson again refresh okay now again uh let's check with next functionality uh, here is mobile laptop and here is your grocery but it's not a uh, refresh after this uh, insert successfully automatically we need to manually refresh it so how can you manage this so yeah after after successful uh, insertion we need to reload so window dot reload okay let's check again refresh it electronics and save it's not working right now let's see what's happening right there okay it's not working right now let's check in the code okay it's not window we need to write location location dot reload okay i refresh it and again write another category name category name will be cloths okay cloths and click on the save now it's loaded automatically now in the next video you are working on the pagination method because we don't need to fetch all the line all the lines at a single page so let's meet in the next video thank you so much and stay with me happy coding